fashion industry is a $3 trillion industry. It is also the second largest polluter after oil. These facts mean that we are consuming irresponsibly. Just one t-shirt can require up to 2,700 litres of water to produce. The same amount of liquid that fills 8,181 cans of coke. 2,700 litres of water could instead be somebody's drinking water for three and a half years. The fashion industry also has a chemical impact. Dyes contain harmful chemicals that can be deadly to aquatic life. Greenpeace have found that the Chittorum River in Indonesia, which 35 million people rely on for drinking water, is one of the most polluted rivers in the world, with the hundreds of textile factories along the shore contributing hugely towards this. The fashion industry also accounts for 10% of all carbon emissions, partly due to the number of miles travelled throughout a garment's life cycle, especially as labour is sometimes cheaper in countries where the raw materials are not grown. There are also issues surrounding the welfare of workers in the fashion industry, with some garment workers spending up to 18 hours in a factory per day, being paid very little. Finding a solution to this problem is important to me as I, like many others, love to shop, but find these facts really worrying. I have an idea that could hopefully enable us to become responsible consumers in regards to fashion. Which of these two shirts is more sustainable? At the moment, we cannot tell. Mandatory nutrition labelling provides us with all the information we need to make an educated decision regarding what to eat. What if a similar system was applied to garments? Numerous factors would influence each indicator, with climate change, water consumption, chemical impact and ethical workforce being the main indicators. Scales for each indicator could be devised and a colour coding system could be implemented just like nutrition labelling, so the severity of the sustainable impact of a garment could easily be recognised by a consumer. Sustainable labelling could be added to every garment, both online and in store. Here's how it would look online. Here's how a garment label could look with my proposed sustainable labelling. The addition of sustainable labelling would mean garment sustainability could easily be compared. Here, just by colour and scale score, we can see that this is the more sustainable garment between the two. We should not just be able to compare the sustainability between garments, we should also be able to compare the sustainability between brands so consumers can make responsible choices regarding where to shop. An eco-report button could be added to the homepage of every fashion brand, linking it to the sustainability report of that brand. Currently, it can be really difficult to access company sustainability reports. The button could be colour-coded from red to green, giving the consumer an instant insight into how sustainable a brand is. These ideas could help us to become responsibly consuming individuals, which could create sustainable communities which in turn would have a global impact. Sustainable labelling and the addition of an eco button could help us reach the global goal of responsible consumption, hopefully encouraging companies to adopt sustainable practices and improve public sustainability knowledge. If people were to use the labelling to make more responsible clothing decisions, it could also affect many more of the global goals.